Hey, how's it going everybody? This is Craig Peters here from Sound Iron, and in today's walkthrough we're going to be checking out Rain Song, which is a free collection of Rainwave audio files, which we created back in April 2020 as part of a rainy day songwriting competition. Within this library you'll find a collection of different rain ambiences like rain hitting car hoods, thunderstorms, traffic, downspouts, bird calls in the forest, and much more. And all of these nature field recordings have been carefully captured in wide stereo. We've also included a series of one-shot drips and impacts so you can easily make your own aqua percussion or uniquely wet sound effects. And after that we sound designed 58 atmospheric pads, drones, and environments straight from the source content, packed it up into our four layer modular UI, and created 20 custom effects presets. So without further ado, let's dive in and start checking out Rain Song. So after you load up Rain Song, you'll see that it comes with our four layer modular user interface and this allows you to have four different layers to be able to blend different ambiences and different sounds and be able to create some unique combinations. So on the bottom right of the user interface, you'll see that you have a couple drop downs. You have this drop down, which has the different categories, and then this drop down will have the different sound sets. So right now we have Rain Song loaded up and we got these rain loops, so let's check these out. So you got these different rain environments. Let's go ahead and check out these one shots. And then if you want to take any of these sounds and spread them across the key range, you can do that easily by clicking this button. And then if you want to undo that, you just click that button again. For this library, we also sound designed 58 different atmospheric pads and drones for you to use. So I'm going to go ahead and check out this first set. And then you'll see when you click this, you have uh, just the first set of all the different ambiences. So let's just play through some of these.
Let's go ahead and have a listen to some of the ambiences in set two. And then you can utilize the different layers to combine different sounds together. So if we want to go into layer three and let's pick one of these ambience. And then what we can do is learn our mod wheel to the X fade. And then we can even bring layers in. So let's on layer three, set this to layer B and then we'll keep layer one as is. Let's go to layer two and let's pick another ambience. Let's find something from set one and just pick something random. So we can set this one to layer B as well. So we're fading that one in. And then for layer four, we'll go ahead and add some of the sounds from the sub synth. This is using a sine soft. You can even pitch this down. And then if you want to start adding some effects, we can head over to the effects rack and you'll see you have all these different slots to choose from. So let's check out some of these. Let's go and add a delay. And then I'm going to sync this. Add some more reverb. Let's uh, choose the cathedral and let's check out some of these different impulses. So let's check out the far D. Then 
we got some other effects. We can add some flanger. Or we can add some lo-fi. Get that kind of big crusher sound. Or we can add a rotator. And then if you click the settings icon up top, you'll see it opens up the advanced tab and here you have some other sound design possibilities. You got some LFO, some filter, and some arpeggiation. So if we want to experiment and add a little bit of that LFO effect, we can turn this on. I like to select pan. And then adjust the intensity. And you can choose to type waveform. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and play for you some of the custom effects presets that come with the library. There's 20 to choose from, and these are all handcrafted, designed by us to give you some inspiration and get you composing quick. So let's go ahead and check some of these out now. All right, so that about wraps up this walkthrough for Rain Song. If you'd like to learn more about this library and download it for free on our website, make sure to go to soundiron.com. I want to thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to stay up to date on future videos like these, and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care.